Rogers getting to Ellison early, but man, she settled in. Yeah. After that bottom of the first, really settled in and really hampered the Gator hitters, fooled them, moving the ball in and out, moving it up and down in the strike zone. And it's no fluke. Last year she was 39 and 6, 1.11 ERA in her work. So yeah. This is a program that has been good for a long time. We talked about it yesterday. 21 years in a row leading up to this year, they've been in the NCAA tournament and won at least 40 games. So this is a team under Jerry Glasgow that has just continued excellence. Yeah, and the expectations were really high for Louisiana coming into this season circle. Probably good, good right fielder. Yeah. 2-2. Two -two. Swing and a ball on the ground to Lindemann. Scoops it out of the dirt. Tags the bag. There's out number one. And she wanted to make sure she caught it, not getting it on a hop. So let me go over and spot. We saw that yesterday as well. 1-1. One, one. Aldering swings, line drive, back up the middle, hops into center field for a base hit. The second baseman rips one up the middle and puts a runner on with one out. Southern Conference selection in her freshman year at Miami-Dade College before she transferred to Louisiana. 1-1. One, one. Swing and a ball popped up towards short. Reynoso Fields throws to first. Not in time for the double play, but it will put the second out on the board. That's in game one for Lugo. Here's the 0-2. Swing and a miss. Fourth K of the series for Natalie Lugo. First of the day, and it retires the side. Just like yesterday, the Gators face one above the minimum. Via Reynoso in the usual eighth spot. 0-1 Adams. Swing and a bouncer on the ground through the right side. Pass all to Rankin to right field for a base hit. Laid off single for Hannah Adams. One, two. Let him in swings. Pops one up towards the left side of the infield. Dancing around is Mayu. Camps underneath it towards the outfield grass. And retires one on the squeeze. To walk ratio. And she was fantastic yesterday for Louisiana. One, one to Eccles. Swing and a fly ball lifted towards center. O'Neal on four steps. Now five steps forward. Runs underneath it in stride. It makes the grab. Initially had a lot of carry towards center. The wind started to make a dive. Team on her shoulders today. 2-2. Goddard swings, roasts one on the ground, up the middle, off the glove of a diving shortstop, Dalton into center for a base hit. A two-out single for Goddard, two on for the Gators. Rain O'Neal in center, showing her speed, getting that ball in a hurry, keeping the Gators, Adams, at second, not allowing her to advance to third. But a big opportunity here for Jordan Roberts with two on the pond for Florida. Roberts second on the team with 21. Twists, 0-2. Roberts swings on the ground, up the middle. This will escape into the outfield. Adams rounds third. No throw to the plate, and the Gators are on the board. RBI single for Jordan Roberts. It's one to nothing. Good piece of 0-2 hitting for Jordan Roberts. And gets the Gators on the board first. And for Jordan Roberts, second on the team, her 22nd run driven in on the year. Gators with a little two-out magic. And they take a one-nothing lead in the bottom of the first inning. First and second again for Florida. Goddard now at second. Roberts trying to get some more two-out production for Florida. Pitch. One-two. Line drive into left field. This will drop for a base hit. Goddard is held at third. And the bases are loaded thanks to another two-out single. This one from Jamie Hoover. Jamie Hoover just turns on a ball and drills it. Between close, but just a little bit off the wide of the plate. It'll be full. Two outs in the inning. Gators up one to nothing. Bases loaded. Payoff pitch. Swing and a fly ball towards left. Backtracking is Hudak, who makes the one-handed squeeze and a hop and retires the side. Gators leave him loaded, but in that inning, an RBI single from Jordan Roberts gives Florida the early lead. We go to the second. 2-2. Two -two. Swing and a miss. Second K of the day for Natalie Lugo. One down. You mentioned the double she had, but she's also Sunbelt's second team a year ago. One, two. Swing and a miss. Back-to-back -back Ks for Natalie Lugo will put two down for Louisiana. That's Lugo's third straight strikeout for the second half of the year. 3-1. Swing and a soft pop up to Reynoso, fading back towards left field, makes the over the shoulder grab, and that will retire the side. Three up, three down, two Ks for Lugo in that inning. In the circle for Florida. The Tall, righty, lanky pitcher. Righty pitcher enters, first toss to Reynoso, swing and a short hopper towards third, fielded by Mayu, rhythm toss across as well in time. One, two. 
Lindsay swings on the ground through the right side all the way into the corner. This will be extra bases. Lindsay around first, will round second. Here comes the throw, dives into the third head first, and it's a triple for Cheyenne Lindsay. Her first of the season, and the Gators get a runner on the doorstep with just one out. Good piece of hitting in between the first and second base into right field. Just drives it, turns on it, and it gets past. It looked like she was going to glove it in right field, did Morgan Gray, but it gets all the way to the wall, allowing her to get to third. First triple of the season for the Florida Gators comes from number to like a basket, clamps the glove, settles in, 3-0. And that's low, ball four. Four pitch walk to Adams. Second time she reaches today. That'll bring two two. Let him in swing, sends a high fly ball deep towards right center. See you later. Kendall Linneman goes yard deep over right center, and it's Florida. Up four to nothing. Kendall Lindeman delivers opposite field home run, her fifth of the year. And runs driven in 16, 17, and 18. Second home run of the series for Kendall Lindemann. And the Gators up mightily in the bottom of the second. You just knew. The second and left her bat. Yes. You knew that it had the mustard to get over that green wall. Still one out in the inning, Florida four, Louise Anderson, who pitched the first inning. Payoff pitch to Eccles. Eccles swings, taps one on the ground to second, having trouble is Aldering. Throw to first, though, will be in time. Does it again, here's the 3-2. Goddard swings, bounces it on the ground to third. Two hops, Mayu fields, throws to first to Boswell, hitting over. Good contact, can get you back in rhythm. Swing and a miss at a high pitch on the outside corner. Fourth strikeout of the afternoon for Nat Tigers. The one two. Swung right through it. Another strikeout. Make it five on the day for Natalie Lugo, who has found a groove in that number one spot. Here's the 0 2. Drill deep. Hoover going back, moving towards the right field line. It falls about a foot inside the left field line. And she'll throw it back into third, but not in time. Wow. Dalton on a motor got all the way to third base. A triple, a two-out triple for Alyssa Dalton. Aldrink steps back in the left-handed batter's box, looks at that pitch, and will now walk to first base with the base on balls. Third walk she has earned. Put something on the ground of the outfield. You can score that runner at third. Melissa Mayu swings at the first pitch. CC's going back and can't get it is Reynoso. Hoover will grab it behind her and quickly throw it to third, but it is a... Single just over the outstretched glove of Sofia Reynoso, scoring easily from third. Moving at the crack of the bat was Alyssa Dalton. So Louisiana on the board. It's now 4-1 Florida with a three-run lead. It's 4-1 Florida. Here's the 1-1. One -one. Right back at Lugo, and she'll make the grab on a ball that was just floating over her left shoulder. She goes back and gets it. But not before Louisiana scores a run here in their while. She has had a handful of doubles. She's had five since then. Payoff pitch drilled high in the air. Just into the grass goes to shortstop. Dalton calls off the left fielder coming in. Here she is pitching on Sunday again after getting the save yesterday. That pitch popped up right into the circle and Kleist just to him. Of course, Cottrell saw Ellison the first time up. Turns on this one into the outfield. Raina O'Neill drifting to her right will make the play. And the Gators go quietly here in the home half of inning number three. It's pretty windy yesterday. 15, 20 mile an hour winds blowing pretty much all day. As Thank goodness I had you blocking me, Tom. Yeah. <laughs> the left-handed hitting Hudek swings and misses at high heat. Sixth strikeout of the afternoon for Natalie Lugo. Lafayette before Friday and they said that was kind of a problem for them at times this year was the offense and their consistency. 2-2 two -two pitch. Swung on, driven into center field for a base hit. Played out there by Caraway, who's now in center field, ranging to two on for Louisiana here in the top of the fourth. 4-1 Four Florida. Here's the pitch. Swing and a miss. Seventh strikeout victim of Natalie Lugo. Second time. 2-2 two -two count. Deuces wild on the board. 
Here's the pitch, two outs, swing and a miss. Throw over to first, another strikeout. The throw to first to complete it. Eight, two, two pitch. Swing and a miss for Reynoso. As Lindsay awaits another 2-2 offering from Kleist, here it is. Chop towards short. Dalton on a hop, gets it across the diamond to Boswell. And Lindsay is retired 6-3. Well, she had the best view of it down the third base line. Yeah, that's her call to make. Left-handed hitting Adams. Swings at that one, chops it towards second. Alderink coming in, makes the play, the short toss over to Boswell at first. And the Gators go 1-2-3. He's now playing in Louisiana. 3-1. Swing and a line drive lifted towards right. Coming in is Hoover. Can't get underneath it in time. Second hit of the day for Alyssa Dalton. She's got a single two for Riley Lugo winds up. Pitch to Alderink. Swing and a fly ball towards left. Ranging to her right. And making the grab for Florida is Cheyenne Lindsay. That'll put one down. Louisiana. Pitch. 1-0, swing and a hard hit, ground ball on the ground to third, toss to second for one, turn to first, double play. How about another DP for the Gators in this series? The defense firing on all cylinders, and that will retire the side. The Rage and Cajun send just three to the plate. Four. Twist and the 1-1. Eccles swing, sends a fly ball high in the air towards center. O'Neal camping under it, four steps to the right. One-handed squeeze, and there's two away. Can you guess who the previous? Pulled up four to one, here's Goddard. Oh! And that got her right on the hip, and she will trot to first. <laughs> that hurt. That was a quick at bat, you ready? <laughs> yeah. Uh, can I get one more? We'll give you uh, one okay. more. Wow, I'm, I'm a generous guy today. I was going to say, that's very generous. My Just say she's multi-purpose player. She was oh, for Florida. I know who it is. Here's the 1-1. One -one. Swing and a high pop-up out towards second. Alderin camps underneath it. Two steps back, two-handed squeeze, and that will retire the side. Was it Alicia Ocasio? Florida continues to turn double plays this weekend. That's now five against Louisiana. 0-1, swing and a slow roller to Lugo. Fields throws to Lindemann at first well in time. That'll put one away. Yesterday had a couple of errors against this Louisiana team. Here's Houdet. Swing and a line drive into left center. Curls down for a base hit. She will stop at first, a one-out single for Houdet. And you just said it, a one-out single. Great. She's got eight today. 1-1, one, one, swing and a fly ball lifted high. Deep towards left center, and it's off the scoreboard. Louisiana not done yet. A deep shot over the green wall, and they're back in it. It's 4-3. to three. Wow. An oppo at the scoreboard for O'Neal. And it's a one-run game. Well, initially, it looked like it might have tapped the bottom of that Florida scoreboard, had just enough to get over that green wall. And the biggest of home runs for Raina O'Neal. That's her third of the season. That ties her with three other Rage and Cade for the sixth inning. Third time around, they're seeing a little bit better. 3-2, Gunner on the outside corner, strike three. Now Wandered a lead in game two yesterday. Roman at the first pitch, swing and a high line drive, deep towards center. One hops off the wall over the glove of Caraway. Green line around third for Rawls. She will score, no throw to the plate. And it's an RBI double for Taylor Roman. And Louisiana has tied the game in the top of the sixth. Taylor Roman went to the plate with a purpose. First pitch, she sees she's going to take a rip at. Taylor Roman knocks in the run for Louis. One in the third. Goose eggs with the fourth and the fifth. Now tied at four. Three, two. In the dirt for ball four. Another walk issued by Natalie Lugo. That's her second of the inning. Tied at four. The 0-2. Swing and a pop up in the infield right side. Adams coming in on it. Lindemann gives her a bump on the shoulder. They almost collide, but Adams makes the squeeze. And Ellison. Settles, twists, 2-2. Two, two. Over swing, sends a fly ball towards shallow right. Racing in, making a diving grab is Roman. And that'll record the out. Ball was dropping at the last second. Roman had to lay out to make the grab. Take the lead as they fight in this decisive game three. 
One, two, swing and a trampoliner towards short, gets away from the shortstop Dalton and rolls into the outfield. Jade Carraway will reach with one out. And the go-ahead run is aboard. And that's soft. 0-2. Oh, Matthew swings, fly ball, twisting towards left. Tally on two steps back, makes the grab and retires two. Adam six. One, two. Lindsay cuts and misses. Second K of the day for the Louisiana staff. First for Ellison, and that will retire the side. We go to the final scheduled frame. Florida four. And the 2-2. Two -two. Check swing, gutter. Another strikeout for Natalie Lugo. Ties her season high with 11. Today for Natalie Lugo, two outs. Left hand hitting Hudek is up. First toss, swing and a line drive towards left center. One hops in the gap, will bounce in the glove of Lindsay. Has trouble with it, drops it. Rounding first and sliding into second is Hudek. One two is en route. Swing and a line drive. This into right. It'll get down off the bat of O'Neill for a base hit. Around third, the throw home. Not in time. They throw to second and do not get her either. O'Neill is into second base, fans disagreeing. The run scores for Louisiana, and the Raging Cajuns have taken the lead 5-4. to four. O'Neill delivers after the home run, an RBI single to give the Raging Cajuns the lead. She'll go to second on the throw into home plate. Oh, well, officially, I hate to correct you, Tom. Oh, no, you're right. Sixville trying to take the series from Florida after losing on Friday night. Boswell to the plate, right hand hitter, two outs, first toss. Swinging a fly ball, well struck deep towards left field, and it's gone. A two run shot from Kerry Boswell. And just like that, Louisiana takes a three run lead. Boswell came up to the plate with one thing in mind. She knew Lugo was going to give her one. Inside of the ankles for ball four. She Chronister has to win Friday night. Chronister out of 1-2 to Roman. Missed off the plate for a ball. Runner goes from first. The throw in time for the out. Rage in cage. Whoa. Adams took it on the helmet. Shakes it off, no problem. Pumps the fist as she trots down to first. A hit by pitch, and it's a start. Adams is aboard. Body box. Ellison twists in the 0-1. Lindemann swings, pops one up high in the air, fading back towards home plate. Will land into the glove of the catcher, Rawls, and put one down. By pitch. They could use Eccles' big bat in this moment. Toss. Eccles swings, sends a high fly ball deep towards right field, and that's into the treetops. Florida not done yet. A two-run shot from Charlotte Eccles, home run number seven this season, and the Gators are back within one. RBI 25 and 26, team leading in that category as well for Charlotte Eccles. And that ball was given a ride. There should be a stewardess on that flight. Was she due and did she deliver? Sharla Eccles with a blast deep in the right field. And Florida's back within a run. Two strikes, pitch to Goddard. Goddard takes a strike down the heart of the plate, strike three. Second K of the day for Ellison, and the Gators are down to their final out. But as you mentioned, a player at the plate. Into it. Bottom of the seventh, two outs, first toss, swing and a bouncer to short. Fielded by Dalton, rhythm toss across, well in time, game over. And the Raging Cajuns have come into the home of the Florida Gators and taken the series. Final score, Louisiana 7, Florida 6.